I've transferred all the purchases from my old iTunes library to my new computer using the home share method. And I've resubscribed to podcasts and I transferred my apps from my iPhone after I hooked it up. I also did a backup of it. But still, if I click on sync apps or try to sync anything else, I get this message saying that they'll all be replaced. And the big thing is the apps and you don't want to have to reset them up. So here's a pretty easy way to set up your new computer so you don't have to reset up your iPhone. First, you want to go to your um, iTunes folder and make a backup of the iTunes library file and a backup of the iTunes music library file. Now using a text editor, I use a, a Notepad++, open that file and you want to copy over the iTunes music library file from your old computer which I have here and open that file. Now <clears throat> the instructions that I found said to copy this ID over here and that everything would be fine. When I did that it didn't work. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make changes to the old file and then copy the whole old file into the new library. And all you really need to do is worry about the string here. Since I'm using Windows 7, the string is a lot different. So using Notepad++, I can do a search and replace. I want to replace this string with this string from my new library. And it will, whoops. All right, let's try this again. Replace that string with that string. Now, it will replace these here, which are the really important ones. So we'll do replace all. And then I will control A to select all, control C to copy. This is the new file, control A to select all, control V to paste, and then control S to save. Minimize this. We go back to our iTunes folder and we want to edit the iTunes library file. Uh, before we do that, we need to close iTunes. All right. Now here you just want to put in some junk characters because you're going to corrupt this file. And then we'll minimize this. And let's open up iTunes again and see what it says. See, it says importing iTunes Music Library.xml. It's not valid. Click OK. And now it's reprocessing everything, which is good. All right. Now, re ask if you want to transfer your purchases. Say so transfer. OK, so the uh, apps have all transferred. And I get this message podcasts on the iPhone cannot be synced because all the podcasts selected for sync no longer exist. For some reason, after doing this, the podcasts get all erased. It's not a huge deal. I can just recopy them from my home share. Um, or I can just re download them. But now, when I go to apps, you see everything synced. All my settings have been saved. So that's that. Now if I sync my iPhone, I won't lose everything. And that's that. You have successfully synced your iPhone without losing all your data to a new computer. Hope this helps.